March has got off to a decent start with three rises in a row after a 4% fall in February. Now that fall, and more particularly the big decline and then rise last year, got the valuation of the market as a whole back to average. The price of all shares is 14.3 times their forecast profits over the next 12 months, which is equal to the long-term average. Analysts are only forecasting profit growth of 1%, which is why below average prices equal an average valuation. Today's rise was 0.6%, supported by decent gains among banks and retailers. There was a nasty prang on Biotech Street. Rhythm Biosciences, which is developing a blood test for colorectal cancer to replace stool samples, fell 40% because it's had to withdraw its 1,300-page application to the Therapeutic Goods Administration and put in another one, which has really given shareholders the stool samples. The New York market had a solid rise on Friday, which prompted similar gains in Asia today. Gold and black gold went up quite strongly on commodity markets, and the Australian dollar is around about steady at 67.5 US cents. And finally, a couple of random charts from the random charts file. China has come out of the pandemic as a global car exporting powerhouse, easily overtaking America and South Korea, about to overtake Germany, and hot on the exhaust pipe of Japan. And this one shows eating out as a percentage of what it was before the pandemic. Now, other countries are just back to where they were. Australia, more than double. And that's finance.